All right. We just got done with the uh, second taxi in this aircraft, at least second taxi for me. me today we used the number two engine, uh, which was a new experience for me as previously we'd done number one engine. Today started up great, number two engine, good temperatures, good pressures, good nozzle indication, and uh, good hydraulics. So uh, we didn't throw our control checks, uh, came off the chocks, went out to the runway, uh, held short of the runway a little bit, went out to the runway, ran up to about 95%, released the brakes. Uh, it was decent acceleration, but all you guys that have heard about the Lightning is that it's phenomenal acceleration with two engines, uh, dry power, let alone afterburner. So I'm looking forward to the time that we actually use max mill power and or afterburner, because then I think it's a rocket. So, so we went down the runway, uh, got the plane slowed up, exited, Taxied back here again. The uh, the aircraft's very straightforward with taxiing, uh, responsive brakes, free castering nose wheel. Got the airplane stopped. Uh, handed control of the airplane over to Phil, and then we just kind of uh, brought the throttle up to about 98% uh, a couple times for the crowd over here. So uh, again, I just want to say it's really a thrill to be standing here in Stennis, Mississippi, and dealing with the uh, English Electric Lightning. Uh, T5 because uh, I've really enjoyed this airplane since the 60s so to be involved with it's really a, a pleasure for me.